So I'm spending some time tonight looking through Dash Trader Pro, checking out some of the features, some of the menus, just going through every menu, figuring out if there's anything that I'm missing, things that I should add or click on and watching some videos and learning more about Dash Trader Pro so that I can be a better trader using it. One of the things in the past that I've really missed with using Dash Trader Pro over using Thinkorswim is I miss the Active Trader ladder. And after some research, I found out that you can actually set up Dash Trader Pro so that it kind of resembles the Thinkorswim ladder to the sense that I can buy and sell by clicking on level two orders, getting in and out of my trades. I can buy by clicking this icon right here, obviously being buy, and then I can short sell over here on this side, clicking on the sell side or the buy side, obviously. And it's a pretty cool feature. And to do this, all you need to do is literally you're gonna right click on the level two and go to level two configuration. And inside of there, you'll see here on the column and you're gonna add this, you're gonna add CXL and then add order. So once you add those two, you'll see them pop up on there and you'll go to commit. And once it's committed, you'll see it pops up over here. And now on level two, you'll actually be able to buy with one click and sell. So pretty cool feature just by clicking that buy or sell feature there. The one thing you have to remember is in your montage, you'll need to have your share size set up ahead of time. So normally I just have a setup with my template. So it goes to my default order, which will be a limit order and having my thousand shares or sometimes, you know, I can click really fast and change that. And then also if I'm clicking up here, it'll buy at that price that's on level two. So if I wanted to buy at 188 as my limit, I would just click buy and my order would show up over here normally during market hours. Obviously it's the weekend, so it's not gonna show all the different orders in level two. But pretty cool feature, something that I'm definitely gonna use in the upcoming week, something that I feel like it's gonna help me get in and out faster than just before I was you know, watching level two and kind of keeping an eye on it and then coming down here and clicking. I prefer using the mouse just because I feel like I'm just really fast at clicking around and I've been a gamer and done things in the past where I've just really worked on my kind of coordination with my mouse. The problem with hotkeys is I feel like I'm gonna click the wrong hotkey. Maybe over time I'll get more comfortable and I'll use some hotkeys, but for now, I'm just gonna click in and out the way that I trade. The way that I trade is I kind of always, you know, ahead of time know what my stop limit, what my profit area is gonna be and kind of get me in and out. So I'm literally ready to click in and out at the sight of either of those happening, either being my profit target or my sell stop loss area. So keep an eye on level two now. This is a pretty cool feature for me. Some people that I've talked to have used Thinkorswim in the past that have also liked the active trader feature. Now you can set this up with your Dash Trader Pro and use that as well. So pretty cool feature. Here, you never know, you know, you just going through all the menus and looking at things and kind of figuring out the settings over time, you'll get it more and more dialed in Dash Trader Pro. I'm pretty excited to trade next week now with this new feature here on level two, so I can just click buy and sell.